If Tekken 8 is crashing, freezing or not launching on your computer, then this is how you can fix it. Now the first thing that you need to do is download a program that I created called Easy Game Utility. Once you've downloaded it, the first thing that you need to do is click on clean next to Steam Cache Files. You then need to click on OK. You then need to scroll down and then click on clean next to your graphics card to clear your graphics card cache files. So I've got an AMD, so I'm going to do that there. Once you've done that, the next thing that you need to do is click on the DirectX shader cache files and click on clean and OK again. Next, we need to go across to fix and you then need to go all the way to the bottom and go browse. You now need to locate the Tekken 8.exe. Now, once you have found the .exe, you can see it's right there on my screen. It will be in within the Tekken 8 folder. You then need to click on open. You now need to select Steam if that's where you're launching the game from. At the moment, it's only available in Steam, which is why I'm selecting Steam. You then need to click on attempt fix. Now this is going to run through a load of different troubleshooting methods and attempt to fix the game. And once it's finished, it will then launch it. If the game doesn't launch after running through the troubleshooting method, don't worry because it would have still done some stuff. Go ahead and launch the game manually. So you can see there it's now launching Steam on my computer and it's about to attempt to launch the game in a few seconds time. And there we go. As you can see, it's now launching Tekken 8. I'm just going to Alt and Tab now and click on Close and close down the game. And we will start looking at other things you can do to fix the game. Now the next thing that you need to do is ensure that Windows is up to date and you can do this by right clicking on the start menu icon and then go to settings and click on update and security and then clicking on the check for updates button. Make sure you install all updates. Also you're going to want to make sure you have the latest driver installed for your graphics card. If you're not sure what graphics card you have then you can right click on the start menu icon and go to device manager and you can then expand display adapters and you will see your graphics card there. Go to the NVIDIA AMD or Intel website. I will pop links in the description below and download the latest driver. The links I will pop below will be links to some guys that I've done on how you can update your graphics card driver. Now, once you've done all that, if none of that has fixed the issue that you're having with the game, the next thing that you need to do is ensure that none of your programs or apps are conflicting with the game. So make sure you have everything closed before launching it. And also if you have a third party security program installed, then put it into a passive, silent or game mode. Once you've done that, again, try launching the game. Now the next thing that you need to do is open up Steam. Now once you have Steam open, you now need to find Tekken 8 in your games library. And I just want to quickly add that new picture on Ark there looks amazing. I can't wait for Ark 2 to come out. Anyway, right click on Tekken 8 and go to properties. You now need to go down to installed files and click on verify integrity of files. Wait for this to load once it's finished, then try launching the game again. If that didn't help, then the next thing that you need to do is open up File Explorer. Once you have File Explorer open, click in the address bar, do the percentage symbol and type in local app data and then the percentage symbol. You now need to find P, so type P and then find Polaris, I think that's what it's called. Open up this folder. Go into the save folder and right click on config, go rename and just add CS or BK to the end of the folder. If you also downloaded the Easy Game Utility, you will be able to find the location by using that program. It's very easy. I always update it with the latest games when you click on find um, config files. Anyway, once you rename that, launch Tekken 8 again and see if that helped. Now that does bring me to the end of this video. If you enjoyed this video, click the like button below. And if you want to see more of these videos, then click the subscribe button.